Dr. Leisure here, down looking north from the Pualai in McKenna State Park. We're looking on the hillside for the wedge-tailed shearwater. We're looking in burrows where the wedge-tailed shearwater has traditionally laid its eggs in the past. We find that the shearwater has never left. Its remains are still here from last year. There is no sign of any living bird that I can determine. A number of burrows are checked and you can see them here. They're empty. Instead, we find a wing feather or the rib cage of a mature adult. A scan of the surrounding hillside shows more potential burrows, but again, no sign of any living bird. The death of the Shearwater Colony is indicative of the death of McKenna State Park. Looking north, we see the Prince Hotel, once tucked in a hollow. Today, it stands out. The surrounding bluffs and trees have been removed. In the foreground is an archaeological site surrounded by an orange fence. Once a ravine in a bluff, it now sits as a hill Seeing this hillside out of context, no one could possibly imagine what this site must have looked like when the ancient Hawaiians were here. Indeed, no one could imagine what this area looked like when the Prince was built in 1986. The natural grandeur of the area and the history of its people has been stripped away and destroyed. The remains are not unlike the bones of the Shearwater. For more information, check out drleisure.com. Thank you.